Hey guys, so oh my gosh, there must be a champ going on or something. Please don't mind my outfit. I was meaning to get on earlier today and I have not had the chance to get on, which is because I'm still a college student. This is my senior year. And honestly, this whole semester has been nonstop project after project after project. I wanted to go ahead and get on later tonight because the new Dutch Warm Bloods have come out and these must be like the most hyped horse of the year. I'm so excited for these warm these new Dutch warm bloods because they look legitimately like a real horse. As someone who just researched myself, the extended trot, so excited about. These are the new Dutch warm bloods and I don't even know which to get. Also, shout out to Woody. She is one of the sweetest girls ever and in my club. And I haven't seen her forever and I'm so excited to see her. We've all been so busy with school. I'm kind of in love with the dark liver because there has never been a dark liver horse in the game. Then the other one that I love, I love the grays. How many can I buy? I love the dapple gray. I think it's so well done, but this is one of the ones I love. It's the dark bay. And the other bay, I actually am a really big fan of because of the tappling. How many can I buy? This is so bad. And this liver chestnut I want. Because there's never been a liver chestnut. So can I buy like four? Is that ridiculous? I don't know if there's a tater, but one of the first horses I rode was tater. And she was a dark liver bay. But there's also a horse that was named Whimsy at my barn. Did they take away some of the names? The only thing I can think of is Coco for this mare because uh, I'm so excited. I still have my Halloween stuff on, RIP. Like, look how cute. And look at the, oh my God, the veins. Do y'all see that? The veins, <laughs> holy crap. I want this one to be a gelding. And if the name is up, a possible, he looks like one of the horses I've been riding. I'll see if I can insert a photo, but his name is Monty. Oh my gosh, actually, Iron Flame just came out today and I just bought that book. So you know what? We're going to do Iron Flame, aka Monty. Because he looks very similar. If he didn't have any white on his face, he would look identical to Monty. The, can I just do King? Because there was a gray horse at my bar named King. And he was actually a senior, but you wouldn't know. But we're going to name him after King. And he was a Dutch Hornblood. This horse is going to be Hero. I'm gonna insert a photo, but there is a Dutch warm blood that I've photographed and he's a stallion and his name is BHS Hero. And he is one of the most beautiful dressage stallions I've ever run. So it's gonna be Hero. And he looks very, very similar to this horse. Oh my goodness, y'all. Let's go to the... I am so freaking out, the passage! Is that their trot? There's no way, that's just their normal trot? No freaking way. Oh, we're going to the riding arena. Oh, I forgot I have to feed her so that I can see the full gates. I bet a ton of people. Oh my gosh. Wow. Holy dressage. This, so I'm on Night Star and it looks like several people, Steel Bees, are doing a, um, here's the walk. That trot. Oh my god the front knee action on the horses so like what i mean by that is right here for dressage especially in like oh i'm running into people i'm so freaking sorry they really like the high end knee action that is in a lot of dutch warm bloods it honestly appears that the horse is actually on the bit like the horse is tracking under meaning like its legs are fully moving under them I adore it. This is the slow cult for the first canner. It's a collected canner. This is, I think, the most beautiful canner I've seen on Star Stable. Oh my god. Y'all. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at that. That is like 
would be a 10 for canter extension. The only negative thing I have to say is I do wish that the rider was actually sitting down in the full seat and not, or had the option to sit down in the full seat and not just the two seat, half seat that you see in like hunters that, oh, the rear. Wow, wait, did y'all see the, the downward transition? Hold up. I don't have anything like negative or positive to say. I will say a little disappointed, honestly, in the jump. I guess they took more of like a show jumper approach on this horse, and this horse was really designed more with a dressage perspective in mind. That being said, it would be like really cool to see a bit of a more of a bascule in the jump, meaning the horse's knees were more like upright and looked a little more like hunterous. Let's just go in this ring. Oh my gosh, I hate this. Okay. Not the dressage ring, but here's the pee off. Oh my god! It's so balanced. It is so. It looks like a literal freaking horse. That's amazing. Oh my god. Oh my god, the extended trot. Okay, we've got to go back to the riding arena. This is absolutely insane coming down. Oh my god, y'all. The sliding stop is even a collected and correct downward transition. Um, for those who aren't familiar with dressage, we are judged for being correct, meaning the horse is moving in a correct frame and always uphill and balanced and that is the most uphill and balanced downward transition i have seen that is amazing oh my god look there's someone with the same horse as me i love the way that they did the rider with the hands are so light oh my gosh i could die and go to heaven oh my gosh absolutely freaking lutely insane like, wow. Star Stable, honestly, wow. This is absolutely incredible. I... Sorry, y'all, I'm like literally speechless right now. Normally I have a few things to say that I dislike about a horse, but... Wow. I'm just in complete shock. Like, this does not look like a Star Stable horse. This is insane. I'm just in sh awe. There is not a single complaint I have, aside from a jumping perspective. The jump's not the best, but these horses are beautiful. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm hoping to come out with a training video again and a few other fun videos, so please keep an eye out for those. Uh, once I have Christmas break, I will be a lot more active. Uh, love y'all and see you next time. Bye!